My name is Shasta Kano Martin. I'm a sitting council member, but I'm also the secretary for Lummi Indian Business Council. When I was elected to council, um, there was a huge need in the community to see something change within our justice system. Uh, community members were really upset that the judicial system didn't represent them. My name is Nicholas Lewis. I'm a council member for the Lummi Nation. And I think what we're trying to strive for is something uh, that's culturally appropriate and sensitive to our, our way of life. You know, uh, this get tough uh, mentality of lock them up and throw away the key. You know, we kind of bought into that, just like the, the country did. You know, that's why there's so many judicial reviews and reforms going around. You know, everybody's really taken a hard look at at the way practices are. My name is Dean Martin Jr. from the Elimination. I was told that there was no hope for me, there was, that I wasn't going to change, and that there was no kind of program or whatever that was going to save or benefit me. And they were going to revoke my probation and give me a thousand days in jail. And I asked for one chance, and one chance only. And uh, thanks to Nick Lewis and the LCP program, I got that chance, and uh, I've been making the best of it every day. You know, that was my background. I was a probation officer before I was elected to council, um, and I helped um, along with a few others in the probation department um, really create the policies for this program. The philosophy is that you can't um, do work in a meaningful way if you're not um, working on yourself. You know, probation as it currently is is very reactive. You know, if somebody violates it, it's going to take them, you know, it could be up to eight violations, for example, and it's going to take two months to resolve those issues. By that time, the, um, the person could overcome some of their challenges. Maybe they got a job, maybe they got a house, but you're then addressing their violation that they did two months ago. So it, again, it's very reactive. So with the swift and certain, you address it right there on the spot that day. Uh, somebody, for example, tests positive for heroin or meth. They might not go to jail that day, but we address it that day. If they have a job, um, and as long as we can ensure that the safety of the community is insured, we might have them serve the jail time on the weekend or their days off. Again, so we're not trying to um, harm their, their way of life, and, 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 but we're trying to address the problems. It's um, finding ways to support them instead of punishing them and uh, circles as a way to get them connected with community. Yeah. It, uh, to me, it seems like they're they're given respect where respect is due. You know, I mean, they're like I said, they're not looking at all the flaws. They're not looking at all the wrongs. They're respecting people as human beings and not a case file. You know, I'm not just a number and I'm not a statistic. You know, I'm a person. I have feelings. You know, whether they're deep down inside and I have a hard time showing them, they're still there. It's going to create a system that seven generations down is a, a system that really respects and serves the community because it's created by the people.